And right where we left off, we're back with more Yakuza 0. So, I made a little bit of space in my box. Uh, let's see. Right now we have... We have the beer, the potato shochu, and the champagne. One guy wanted whiskey, and the other guy wanted sake. But the, the guy was specific with the whiskey, and I can't remember off the top of my head what it was. So let's just check out the other store. But we need whiskey for sure. There's a restaurant. Uh, we'll check out this one. This one's further away. No thanks. Hey, we'll visit the shrine in a little bit. Joy sound. Hello, sir. Yes, I'm Uh, let's see. Grilled chicken on a stick. Nice. Uh, long tea, beer, whiskey. Uh, I'll try that one. Sake. All right. That's a shit nuts. So true. I think this is good enough. Hopefully, that's good enough. Yeah, yeah. Thank you very much. Alright, luckily last time I ran into some uh, potential quests and some quests or sub stories. I keep calling them quests. Oops. Let's see, we wanna go back to the park. It's a bit of a ways, but not too far. Let's take a fight to start off this episode. What's up, boys? Defeat Sega? Oh, I didn't even notice that was his name. King Cone. Dead. Oh, I'm triggering something. Who the hell is this guy? Huh? Yikes! Hardcore hooligan. Oi. Hey, you alright? Uh? Huh? Huh? Figures I would bump into some swaggering punk. Oi! Oi! You're an old man! Ain't gonna end well. Are you alright? Uh, no. What's the big deal, yeah, yo? I'm sorry. Uh, watch where you step, shit for brains. You're not hurt or anything, are you? Asshole? Uh, I don't think this guy has, has his act right. Alright, if that's how you want this to play out. Daddy. What? Yeah! I'm sorry, so sorry. I mean, I'm in a rush, see? So please get lost, you punk ass and so and so. What the hell is this guy doing? Is he like a wannabe punk? What just happened? Damn janky. Alright. Uh. Hey, look, something's happening here, I guess. Must be connected to that guy, I guess. He ran this way. Hmm? Well, it's a lot of hooligan looking guys. What's going on? It's a rough looking crowd. <laughs> Oi, I'm so freaking stoked, man. A rare street show by the Yokomichi Silvers. Ah. To your right. Look at some rock and roll gods. Look at this bitching crowd. You draw all these punks without any ads or nothing. Crazy Kyo and this Yo Yokomichi Silvers fucking rule. Keep your pants on. But I hear the Yokomichi Silvers are gonna hold a QA panel too. Eh? No fucking way. They're famous for never seeing a word and letting their music do the talking. Wonder what the hell they'll talk about. Seems like some bad's doing an event here. Must be popular with the local punks. Hmm? What the fuck? Are you trying to join the crowd or something? Is that... Hey dude, what are you doing here? 
Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, look at these people. Holy cow, what are we gonna do? Oi. Hey, you. Yikes! How did you not see me coming? You were literally staring at me. <gasps> Jeez, wheeze, pal. I need to repeat my... Uh, what are you doing here chuffing around behind me? You ugly knob. Uh, yeah, sorry. I thought I should apologize for bumping into you earlier. Boy, who? Oh, you're that man. No, I should be apologizing for my own colors. I mean, whatever, piss off. Uh, sure. Uh, awkward? Cool. Wait a second. Could you possibly be unaware of who I am? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you asking if I met before we bumped into each other? If we did, I don't recognize you. Yeah. Oh, wait a second then. So, you really don't know who I am. Willikers, what a relief. Sorry, I was rude. I have to introduce myself. Name's Kyo. But my straight stage name is Crazy Kyo. I'm the vocalist of in the band. I'm assuming it's the band they're talking about. Let me guess, Yokomichi Silvers. Same as those junk punks are excited to see. Whoa, I just noticed there's a water there, and when the camera was moving, it was going kind of crazy near that guy. The, the guy that's sitting down. Uh, if you rewind a little bit, you'll see what I mean. Anyways, the band. The, Aren't you guys some kind of legendary janky band? Yes, that's us. We're gonna street show here later. Huh. Sorry to bug you before your show. Good luck. Whoa! Where do you think the hell do you think you're going, old man? Uh, uh please wait, sir. Don't go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Maybe you can save me. Save you? Nani. What? Are you even hardcore, hardcore in the slightest? See, the water's wiggling there. Nope. As a joke, we tried dressing all punk at a show to our shock. We got pretty popular with the janky crowd. But now we have to keep this charade full time. Over time, we gained a fan base of wannabe punks. And the Yokomichi, Yokomichi Silvers became heroes to the rebellious youth of Japan. The whole style is called Yankee now. Hmm. Mm. It's more to running a band than I thought. So? What did you mean by saving you? I... Uh... Actually, I want you to teach me how to be hardcore, a hardcore hooligan. Nani. Teach you? To be a Jackie? Yes. You see, for today's event, we also have to do a live panel. A meet and greet for the fans. But every member of the Yokomichi Silvers, including myself, are law-abiding choir boys. We never even shoplifted. We were to talk in front of a real Jackie. They realize that we're phonies. Fake punks, eh? Now that you mention it. That way you talk doesn't match how you dress at all. Right. So if we spoke to our fans, we'll lose our credibility and popularity in an instant. Or worse, but they want to prevent us from fooling them. Okay. But well, why do you have to do this panel thing? Why don't you skip it? I don't want to do it either. But our legacy says we need to hone our speaking skills if we want to stay popular. They're making us do this. We've been avoiding every situation where we might have to talk instead of just performing right now. Got it. So, you want to teach me how to behave like a Yankee? You can talk like that. But why me? Why? Well, that would be because you're my ideal of what a hooligan should be. That confident de demeanor. Your razor sharp glare. The barbed wire attitude that says touch me and get cut. And yet, you also exude a sense of kindness. A guy who extends a helping hand for the weak. The hooligan with a heart of gold. That's my ideal Yankee. Well, yeah, I'm Yakuza, kind of. You can teach us so we won't blow our cover. More than that, I think you can give us Yankee wisdom that will propel the Yokomichi Silvers to new heights of hooliganism. Please, if we lose this chance, Yokomichi Silvers may have to break up. Please teach me how to carry myself like a true Yankee. Nah, sure, why not? He's actually being nice about it. I'm not sure how useful I can be, but I'll try. <gasps> really? Thank you very much. I'm sorry I didn't catch your name. It's Kiryu. Okie dokie, Kiryu-san. Give you just a second, please. I'll get the others. Alright. Sorry to keep you waiting, Kiryu-san. This is our drummer. Sleazy Tarishi. Hi. Hey there. I'm Tarishi. My name is Sleazy, but I have no experience with the ladies. Never even seen a boob. And this is our bassist, bad boy Aku. I'm Aku. Obviously, came for elders. <laughs> yeah, 
These guys are real choir boys. And this curious, I was gonna impart the ways of the true Jackie style hooligans amongst us. Please teach us, curious son. You guys are so polite and proper. I start to wonder if there's anything I can do for you. Oh no, please don't say that. We're all pretty good guys at heart, so please help us. In your case, being pretty good guys is the problem. I did agree to do this, so somehow I have to turn you into hard-edged punks. <laughs> oh yes, please. Hmm. How can I show you guys how to be tougher? Mm. Well, maybe you could come up with opening remark for a little old me? Opening remark? Yeah. How to kick off the panel with authority. Being hooligans, we shouldn't come across as weak or hesitant. Please, kid son. I need a singer of an opening light. Set the tone. Uh, yeah. That seems pretty obvious, right? Start your engines. Start your engines. Oh, like a racing truck. Uh. Right. Yankee movement is inspired by Western greasers. They love their wheels. So true. That does go with a Yankee lifestyle. So I should follow with something like, you get my pistons pumping, do you think? Huh, that's good. Wouldn't hurt to throw in something like ram it into overdrive either. <laughs> right, right. I know about that one. I'm so glad we got your advice, Kiryu-san. Oh, oh, oh. Kiryu-san, question. Mm -hmm. What is it? Well, the agency told me to tell the fans how I spent my days off. But I'm not rehearsing or performing. Days off, huh? Makes sense that fans will know about their heroes' li lives day to day. Tarashi, how would you spend a day off? Well, I make a habit getting bright and early so I can make some pancakes. After breakfast, I take my darling puppy Chi Chi Chibi Chan to the park for a mid morning stroll. And then we have lunch at the Chick Cafe to rest our feet. On our way home, we do a little window shopping. After that, I binge the dramas I got on my VCR until it's bedtime. Uh? You just describe a typical girl's day. Huh? Uh, sorry. That really made you sound like a fashionable young woman. I was so surprised that I got intense. <laughs> uh, uh, I'm so scared. Oh no, Kiryu san. You shouldn't shout like that. I mean, Sleeky Tarashi cry. That's a bit much, don't you think? Oh dear. Uh. Sorry. Uh. uh, yeah, my bad, Tarashi. It's, it's all right. I was just startled. Wasn't expecting it at all. So, so how should I spend my day off? Uh, yeah, right. One thing clear: you can't tell the fans how you really spend your free time. No, I, I guess not. But what should I say? What will I be doing instead? Hanging, all, hanging with the mates doesn't sound bad, but this is a punk guy we're talking about that sleeps with girls. So fight it all day for the ladies. That's probably my get this guess. Are you baseball? Spend your day fighting from dawn to dusk. F -f fighting I don't really get it, but do hooligans fight? Do Yankees have sworn enemies or something? It's not about having enemies. Yankees are always ready and willing to fight. You punk slug guys, the fight is on. That's how it is in the main streets of Kamurocho. And just so you know, this one is considered the most hardcore and cool. Jeepers. What a brutal community. I take my I can't take my dog out for a walk in this war zone. Yeah. Hold on. The dogs, the punk, tend to be fiercely and loyal, thirsty for blood. They're often trusty partners in the street. Yeah. Is that right? I can't picture my delicate chibi chan engaging in a kerfuffle like that. <laughs> Boy, I'm glad I could hit up you for uh, hit you up for advice, Kitty san You're the perfect cooling gun role model. Kitty san mm -hmm. You're a bad boy uncle, right? What's the matter? What do I say? You didn't get a toppy like Tarashi? Nope. And he told him to wing it. He's free to talk about whatever, even though he's practically mute. That boy Aku even has a backstory, locked up in Juby, reformer days from birth. <laughs> that boy Aku crushed packs of punks before he even finished preschool. Here he is, he's trying to fit a square peg in a round hole. Aku's a man of few words with a crazy backstory. What should he talk about to make him sound hardcore? A funny event is definitely not the thing. The thing is, he's a man of a few words, so trying to make him actually tell a story might not actually work. So we'll try this one. 
Don't you think it'd be better to just stay quiet? Huh? Stay silent during the panel? What a discussion without any talking about a disaster? Yeah. No. Aku has been told he's free to talk about whatever he wants. That means he's also free to not talk at all. That's true, but it would be worse if you were to say something wrong. Yeah, that makes sense. From Akko's backstory, I think he would seem more hardcore if he kept his mouth shut. When you put it that way, it does make total sense. We'll do that. Bad boy Aku stays speechless during his part. Sure. Aku, are you good with that? Okay. Alright. Now we'll go over how you run this whole panel discussion. Yes, please! Alright, it seems to be going well. Excuse me. Yoko Michi Silvers. We're almost ready for you. Uh? Oh, it's the time. Uh, I mean, fine. Bruh. Yikes! Sorry! I mean, you can come on when you're ready. I'll be watching from the audience. Yes, please, watch us. We're going to hit this hardcore janky thing out of the park. <laughs> We're gonna kick ass and stuff. Mm -hmm. I hope so. But it sounded like they were all ready for it. Here they are. Put your hands together for the Yoko Michi Silvers. Hell yeah, rock it, guys. Crazy Kyo, son. Bad boy Aku over here. Whoa. Check out Crazy Kyo's sounds. It's original ESP guitar. Smoking rat style. That man's got yank the Yankee look nailed. Wow. They are popular. But they're not talking. They do look like real greasers. Something went high school. High rock and roll after school. Tarashi, Aku, hit it, boys. Are we actually gonna hear our music? Oh, maybe not. Success! At least on the musical part. That concludes today's performance by the Yoko Michi Silvers. Just listening to their songs. I can see why the Jackie kids across Japan look up to Crazy Kills Band. Now we would like to move on to a special meet and greet panel with the band members. Whoa, no way, no way! Crazy Kills actually gonna talk to us? That's totally mental! I can't fucking wait to hear bad boy Aku's voice. Here's where it gets real. They better pull this off. Uh? Yo, Grease Hounds. Where the Yokomichi Silvers. Start your engines. Yeah. Crazy Kyo-san. Pull your jets, bros. But again, I hand it to Crazy Kyo-san. He knows how to rev us, rev us up and kick it into top gear. He's totally fucking ace. Thanks for coming rocking to our tunes. We love y'all, you ranting rebels. You're fun to get my pistons pumping right under, right here, under the hood. I love you like my turbo drive. Aw, oh, they're, they're literally orgasming right now. Good. The fans are eating it up. Going by the racing turns to pay it off. Awesome. Thank you, Crazy Kyo-san. Next, we'd like to hear from Sleazy Tarashi-san and Bad Boy Aku as well. First, Sleazy Tarashi-san. Here's a question we got from you. How do you spend your days off? Bruh, me? If I get a day off, I spend it mighty, mostly. This Itarashi is a beast! Fighting like exercise is like exercise to him. Too wicked for words. Oh shit. I would pay to get my ass kicked by Tarashi san. Even just once. Nowadays, that's probably expensive. Just so you know. I don't want anything but my bare go but uh, nothing but going bare knuckle in a brawl. If it ain't a fist, it ain't a fight. Yeah! Good. The fans are eating it up. And you're spending all day fighting with Rip these punks. Oh, uh, he didn't talk about his dog. To close it out, it's time for bad boy Akusan to say a few words. Nothing. Just a death stare. Look into their eyes. Look into his intense eyes. Hm. Th that was it? No way! He stood there for his whole panel discussion? That's... That's... <laughs> Holy crap! Bad Boy Aku's the coolest! What a rebel! He doesn't play by the rules. Not even his own rules. That's making Bad Boy Aku. He rules! Good. What's the right decision to not let the quiet Aku speak? After all, it doesn't take big talk to make a big man and to speak louder than words. Well, I, le I think we did it. Was it a free show? 
Must have been. Give you sound. Were you watching? Yeah, I saw everything. Good work. Give you some. We tried to apply what we learned from you about the waste of the junkie to our panel. <laughs> the fan response was fabulous. I'm still shocked. Uh. Yeah, seems that way. Lies in the world. I'm proud of you. Looks like the Yokomichi Silvers will still keep shooting up towards the stardom of the speed of light. Where were you big time, Kiryu san? You got a wild shirt. Ah, <sighs> that was the most fun I ever had speaking in public. Kiryu san, thanks. From now on, we're gonna keep working hard to expand on what you taught us about the way of the janky. We'll work on our speaking skills as well. Keep an eye on us, Kiryu san. Yokomichi Silvers are kicking it up another gear. Uh. Yeah, give it your best shot. We will. Well, that's neat. People sure have kinds, of, all kinds of talent just to face. At least these guys are diligent. They just survived the rough road of entertainment world somehow. Don't give up, Yokomichi Silvers. Well, that was funny. I like that one. Not as touching as the Akio uh, quest, but good enough for me. Uh, all oh right. I already got all the drinks. We need to go back to the homeless guys. No, actually, this is the Sega I've been to before, right? Yeah. I wanted to check out the other one to see if it had a uh, other games. Where is it? Is it this one? Yes, it is. Okay. Well, we'll go there after we talk to the homeless guys. Uh, yeah, that's very, very good fun. Okay, uh, okay. Yeah, there was, this guy was the sake guy. Just making sure it's not let me pick the wrong thing. Here's your sake, sir. Sake you ordered. Ah, beautiful. This is the only stuff that gets me buzzed. You're the best. And something. Probably thanks. Here's your malt. Here's your beer. Ah, oh, perfect. You're a decent guy for a kid your age. Here's your sweet potato shochu. Nice. That was inducted into the club of connoisseurs, kid. Thanks, but I'm not drinking tonight. What? Get the wrong attitude, kid. When an elder offers you a drink, you drink. Doesn't matter if you're featherweight. That rules. That's the rules if you want to stay ahead. Back when I was a businessman. Mm, I don't know if I believe that one. You wanted the champagne, right? Oh, let me talk to him, game. You have to ask Santa for the next bottle. Merry Christmas. Alright, uh, you're welcome, I guess. Ah, scotch! That's why. Okay, scotch. Scotch, gotta remember that. Alright, so this whiskey was useless. Well, I'm gonna choke it. Alright, so we wanna find some scotch. This store didn't have it. I guess... I don't think Don Quixote had it. I doubt the pawn shot has it. Actually, speaking of which, okay, I do have my plate on me. Let's go hit the pawn shop, I guess, as well. No, oh, I passed it. Well, let's take this fight. Screw it. What do you want? Catch this! Oh, uppercut! Into the sign.
here. Take this home. How did this happen? Alright, you still got the squirrels. Uh, let's see if we can change the... Uh... Change the UFO prices, please. Thank you for waiting. Oh, I still got the same things. Oh, it's a race car game. Hello. Welcome. Let's try this racing game. Why not? One yen. Uh, One hundred yen. He's fucking ready. <laughs> All right, change gears with X, accelerate with B. Oh, I can do right trigger as well. Okay, we'll we'll do that. We'll do the triggers for for acceleration. We can steer with either D pad or th we can only change. Oh, we can change gears with right bumper. That might feel fine. Well, I'll try X instead first though. Uh, B is the okay. That's gonna be a weird. Uh. Get ready. Let's go, Playing classic game. I never liked these kinds of racing games. They hurt. They kind of hurt my eyes a little bit because of the weird like. Gotta go fast though. I think I'm gonna make it, boys. Nope. It's fine, though. Meh. <laughs> Didn't make it anywhere at all. Well, we still got first. We'll use our, uh, how do I change? Oh, uh, I gotta hurry. No, controller drift, stop it. Got a few more seconds. There. How do I exit? Yes, guess right. <laughs> Some really good driving. No, it's not. Don't patronize me. You think so? Thanks. Steering was amazing. I can't believe you crashed into three cars that whole race. I picked up a few tips for my next run. Don't crash. Tips. You play this game too? Hi. Yes. I always love racing games. Eh, not my favorite kind of games though. No kidding. Been playing them for a while, I guess. You're pretty good, huh? <laughs> I'm pretty fast, if I do say so myself. <laughs> you sound confident. I'm no slouch. I could be around for your money. I mean, probably. I did terrible. Oh. I know. 
Next time I get a high score, I'll tell you about it, okay? Sure. That's the way you're made of. Alright. Name's Luca, by the way. What's yours? It's Kitty. Kitty, son. Got it. I guess I'll see you around. We're making friends everywhere. Are you gonna give me free tokens to play games? Mm, I wonder if the other... The other Sega arcade also has a friend person. That we can talk to. Uh, I don't think I saw anyone next to the machines like in this one though. So probably not. But I'll still check next time I go over to the other Sega place. Right, we're still hunting down for... Uh, we need a... Uh, whiskey. But the good whiskey. And also we're going to sell our plate here. So Ruby plate is 10 uh, million. Nice. These are the mount. Peerless uh, some, uh, weapons. 50 million for that? Interesting. But weapons, so you're not selling anything I need. Oh, fishing rod. For 30 million? Oh, it's like a good fishing rod, I guess. Well, we're leaving. See you later, guys. Hmm. I guess I'll double check Don Quixote if they had whiskey or not. Hello. Champagne. I did drink the, the gamer fuel earlier. Uh, doesn't seem like you these guys have that, but I will take uh, a Turner Plus, another one, just to have it. They're pretty cheap. Yeah, I'm not sure where to get the other whiskey that we're looking for. We'll visit that shrine. Uh, we'll try this drugstore, I guess. That guy really wants to play some golf. Get this one. Money magnet. More, any, more money from enemies for 10. Uh, I guess we'll take card watcher here. Card watcher. Okay, so it's probably going to help me find cards. I'll probably do that off screen if I really need to. We'll save up for gotta go fast number two. I wanted scotch, that's right. I just remembered off the top of my head just now. So, I doubt the drugstore is gonna have drinks. But maybe I'm wrong. <sighs> Am I hurt? No. See you later. Hello. Nope, you guys only sell actual, like, good shit <laughs> in terms of recovery. 
Let's see. So I need scotch. I already tried this store. Obviously, the shrine doesn't have anything. The pawn shop didn't have anything. Maybe this one down at the bottom here. And if not, we'll try this one. Imported brands. That could also be where I could get it. So one of these two, probably, right? Uh, we'll try the convenience store first. <coughs> Hello. Scotch. There it is. See you later. Alright, let's get going. Continue with that story stuff though. But the, we've been doing a lot of sub stories in the meantime, so I think there's a good time to finish this up and see if we can keep going with this chapter. Here's your scotch, buddy. Oh ho ho, it pays to ask, I guess. That's gonna be a fun one. I don't know about that. Yeah, I don't know about that. 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 ああ、言われた場所に一日中居座ってるだけ。地上げの嫌がらせにさ。簡単なバイトだよ。ビエンアソ。さっきも一軒終わって、ニットをもらったところでさ。明日からまた違う場所で居座り。さっきまでやってた
Books and videos. Ooh, <laughs> naughty stuff right there. There you are. Were you on your way somewhere, boy? Sorry to hold you up. Uh. Yeah. Want to talk? That's right. Tell me. Have you been training? Yeah. Here and there. Good. Guess I have something I'd like to ask you to do if you're willing, that is. Mm. What's with the hesitation? It's not like you. Ah. Uh, truth is, I've got debt collectors on my tail. Scary ones. Mm. Yeah, I've gathered. Running since we met. No, 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 no. Those two bit jockers are nickel dime stuff. I'm talking about tunas. Famous. And I mean that in the global sense. And now they're here in Japan. Hot on my tail. Hold on. Do you seriously try to escape your mouth of death by fleeing to Japan? Yes. Yes. And this time, there may be no holding going back. I think there's a price on my head. It's too late to pay the money back, then. What are you gonna do, Bacchus? Well, I you could get you to be my bodyguard. Figures as much. Unfortunately, I've got enough in trouble on my plea. Believe me, you'd be in worse danger with me around. Oh, no, that's no way to... Have a heart, please. Sure, I can't pay a retainer, but if you protect me, I'll teach you some of my top shelf moves. The good stuff. Mm. Are these moves better than your credit? Yes. Damn straight they are. They'll do you right in the tight fight, boy boy. Mm. Are you Bacchus? Ah. I think they found me, boy. This is a big scary dev collector, huh? I'm here for your head. Just doing my job, so don't hold it against Daddy. me. Debt collector, more like hitman. No, oh, no, I don't want to die. Please help me, boy. Guess I don't have much of a choice. If I left you, I'd be like putting the bullet in your head myself. You stand back. Thanks, boy. Protecting this guy. For now. I don't especially feel like watching him die. Let's see. Fine. There may not be a price on your head. Well, I'll see if I can figure out a bonus afterwards. Hey. Watch out, boy. I don't like the like look of this one. Way ahead of you. Alright, let's do this. Alright, we're saving Bacchus from the mysterious hitman. Oh, he's got a gun! Let's take out the trash! Dead. Not a very good hitman. Gah. Oi. I'll let you live. Go back and tell whoever ordered the hit to forget about Bacchus, you hear me? Heh. <laughs> Think I'm the only one after this guy? What? There'll be others on his trail soon enough. Don't get what's coming to him. You just walk away, no problem. Excuse me? Ah. Sorry, boy. Why the apology? I, I told you to watch for the knife in your ribs. Yet here I am putting you in danger myself. Don't worry about that. Better hear more about that offer you made earlier. Oh. What? <laughs> you say you teach me some new moves. Better make it quick, though, before the next hitman gets here. You sure about this, boy? I don't have much of a choice. Like I said, I got my own problems, so a few extra survival skills could come in handy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let me feed you in some moves that'll send those hitman really. Alright, so probably if I talk to him I'll learn some new stuff. Uh let's try one I guess, but uh I have a little bit of time, but after this we'll definitely just continue hey, with the story. Bye. Hey boy, you ready ready to learn new moves? Yes. These are the moves I can teach you, boy. Uh, how do I break down defense? That's hand. That sounds handy. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna stay on the defensive. A real hassle. So the right move in a boxing match is to bide your time and wait for the decision. But that's not the way of a true champion. You need the fighting instincts to do whatever it takes to grab and wrench down the other guy. Fighting instinct, huh? Brawling and boxing doesn't have much in common, but I get what you're saying. This is the perfect move for an opponent with a solid defense. I call it the face squeeze. You learn the instance of face twisting. I see. The opponent can break free if you grab their arm or leg. 
But isn't it easy if you're holding their face, even with their guard up, you can have their wave with them. Yes! Yes! You're quick on the uptick, aren't you, boy? You Bacchus, huh? Well, look. A test dummy. Another assassin. This one looks pretty beefy. Where's a bodyguard here knows how to handle himself? That's why I got called in. What? Why you? Professional killers like us always risk getting the getting the tables turned on us. You often hear about the second red hitman being taken down by their target. Yes. Yes, and that's what happened to everyone sent after me so far. Although my boy here doesn't kill them. Well that won't have any happening to me. They call me the un unassailable assassin. Nobody gets past my defenses. So uh, I always get the job done. Except until I do this move on ya. Here's your chance, boy. Uh. I get it. You want me to try the new move I just learned, right? But you're mumbling. I haven't gotten all day, you know? Let's go. Are we just gonna tell us what to do or is it actually a tutorial? Grab their face, twist them to the ground. Oh wait, they have their guard up. Okay. Ugh. Oh, he's fucking dead, dude. I literally like snapped his neck. I don't need to repeat this more than more than once, game. You can just let me go and kill him now, please. He like. I, I snapped his neck three times. He should be dead. Defeat the hitman with his chair. Now. I was ready for that one. Bike. Well, he's a lot tougher than I thought he would be. Oh, I can't switch styles. that get up ow bitch what's this box of nails Okay, I need to just dodge that. Apparently get- Ah! He wasn't too tough, but he had a lot of health. I don't get it. Did you break past my defenses by snapping your neck multiple times? Boy. What's that about second rate hitmen getting taken down by their targets? I mean, you're mad today, so don't come back. I won't. Okay. Thanks for letting Bacchus live. You're getting stronger every day, boy. Uh. Yeah, because I have to thank you for that. Alright. Let's get out of here. We need to go to Champion District, which is pretty far. 
Gotta get there. Actually, let's get a burger. We have a burger on us. Still wait. The burger is sick. <laughs> yeah, fuck yeah. Gotta get that beef. <sighs> I hear some trouble. Nah, fuck you. Let's get some heat action here. So this doesn't have a heat action, it looks like. Fucking death though. <laughs> How can I ever thank you? Please take this. Stamina and Royale. Neat. Oh. Alright, we're almost there. Oh, it's stop and go guy again. Kitty son, type for another stop and search. Uh you can have more pocket tissues. Here you go. Nope. Mm -hmm. Safe as it gets. Yep, you're welcome. See you later. I forgot he was there. Well, here's the champion district. The Shibana guys have been apparently coming here a lot lately. So we'll just walk around. Oh, there's a thing on the map. Nah, see you later, punks. Oh, we're going to the deepest alley. Oi, so gonna anta. Nani shi ni kita. Kono hen de sujimon ni nomasaru mise wa nai yo. Tachibana fudousen no ningen ga kogo ni deiri shite iru te kite kitan da ga. Ima mo iru ka. Anta. また登場会の若い衆が。いや、そうじゃない。あんたらの店を地上げしに来たわけでもない。よく言うな。だったら立花不動産に何の用だ。あの連中のことを知りたいだけだ。あんたらに迷惑はかけない。あまり歓迎されてないようだな。俺らはもうヤクザにうんざりなんだよ。お前らはここらの店をゴミとしか思ってないんだろうが。CA And again, with the knife is ready, but it won't matter. Oh shit, that's a needle. Oh! <laughs> I gave him hepatitis. Ow! No, oh, I wanted to use the bat. Dang it. I understand that. Nanda, nanda, go it's a. Scotia, a hanashi, a kiki, not the critter. I'm turning kegas as a small yanagata. Urua Tachiban of those and Ninging a cocoa de nani or steruka, shitty tight dagger. I know he taught that you're looking an eye. Coco no junior, not a daughter that the soda. ん連中もここで地上げしてるんじゃないのか違うあの人たちはヤクザの地上げから俺たちを守ってくれているあの人たちのおかげで今日のチャンピオン街がある
Interesting. Nandato. So the show, Uda san. Do mo Baragato may was snuck Namasan or Nisanka. Anta Katagi no Ningen to go eat tenagata. Naganaka Shinji de Moranega, Yima Katagida. My wa dojima guminita. Dojima gumikayo. お上は組を破門されたみだ。もう関係ねえ。その元ヤクザがなんで俺らのこと嗅ぎ回ってる。あんたらの社長から手を組まねえかと誘われたもんでな。あ？あんた名前は桐生だ。そんな話聞いてね
Let's see another burger set. Where did we meet him again? Oh, way over here. Uh, if we continue straight on, actually. Yeah, straight on on the left here and keep going. The barber shop. Oh, we have enough for it. Let's go visit the... Uh... Yeah, the way. Oh, another guy. Let's save him. Trying this uh beast style some more. Yaw, yaw, yaw. Man, I destroyed them. Toughness light again. We have enough C we have five CP now. We'll just take this. Let's see. Uh we're gonna save up for all this stuff now. Always in style seems to be handy. So Bacchus is gonna be hanging out in that alley, I guess. Mm. One over, I'm gonna have to fight. No, ah, all right, fine. Put you rush style. We haven't really taken out anyone in a lot with this. I'm, I'm so much faster than this style, Next one over again. Dang it. Right here? Okay. I went to the penthouse. Tabashinane will show up. Now let's go. Well, well. Someone's waiting for us. Oh, it looks like we're not getting a warm welcome again. ちょ。俺は立花から呼ばれてきたんだ。お前ら立花不動産の人間じゃないのか。ここに社長はいませんよ。後で来ることになってるはずだ。部屋で待ってろと言われた。それは何かの間違いじゃないですか。<笑> うちの小田ってもんから連絡が入ってましてね。若いチンピラが来るだろうから死なない程度に可愛がってやる。ジェントルブルーシングはなんだろう。小田がおれ、周り右すんなら今のうちだ。おとなしく帰んなら見逃して
still have rush style, so we're gonna be fast. Alright. Here's some stuff I can use, right? Yep. enough. Managed to dwindle our numbers down quickly with that beast style at least. Yeah look it's Oda, you asshole. You set me up. Oh Oda. Yo Oh my さっきの連中を消しかけたのか。なんでだ。あんただって俺たちを死なさる飯してたろ。ならこっちにもその権利があるんじゃねえかと思ってさ。ま、腕っぷしはそれなりみたいだけど、あの立場の社長がわざわざ
that Tom, Tom's not. Oh, he's almost dead. Okay, why am I running? Let's see the burger do. I guess I can save. Get fucked. I didn't even notice he was almost dead. <laughs> oh look, all the tables at the and I mean the table and all the chairs are fine. Sorry for that pop up. Oda. Not Oda san. ええ。負けですよ、社長。どうなってる。あんたも承知で小田に俺を試させたってことなのか。ええ。小田さんは私にとって掛けがいのない片腕です。だから我々の中にあなたを迎え入れるには彼の了解を取る必要がありました。そう
風間慎太郎ですな,なんだとおやっさんが I had a feeling just because he mentioned the sunflowers way back when. Although that was kind of to intimidate him with the information, but I had a feeling. Anata wa Dojima Gumi no Wakaka Shirahosa. Kuze san kara Kazama san o spy suri o yuwa yemashita ne. Kazama san no kakushimotsu. Kara no hitotsubo no joho o sagure to. Kazama san ga kakushimotte ita joho. からの一つもの所有者を見つけ出すことのできる人間、つまり私のことです。あんたが。我々はからの一つもをめぐる争奪戦で、あの道島組より大きく先へ進んでいる。いずれそのことを知れば、彼らは激怒するでしょう。本気で潰しにかかってくるはず。ですが。それを承知で、あなたが我々と手を結ぶことを他ならぬ。風間さんが望む。Yeah, no、私が風間さんからあなたのことを託されたのは、半年前、あの人が刑務所に入るよりも前のことです。風間さんは、クゼがあなたに近づくことも、あなたが組にいられなくなることも、ほぼ見通していました。いくらおやすんでもそんなことまでわかるわけないだろ、yeah, like, like、風間さんは道島組どころか登場会という組織で頂点へ上り詰めるだけの気量を持った人間ですその懐はあまりに深い風間さんにとってあなたの周りに起こることを予測するのはたやすいはずですそしてその風間さんが空の一つを手に入れる目的はおそらく自分の身を守るなどということじゃない。あの人はもっと大きなもののために絵を描いてるはずです。だったらなんで今おやさんは無所に入ってるんだそれすらも風間さんの計画のうちではないかと私はそう信じています。That is insane. Gorika, it's a little bit of a kid. You son, Tajibana. Antago, your son, no issue, taxer than in the show. Proof Kazama Sango Sharing. ではこれからどうぞよろしくお願いします。I need new allies, new foes. Complete chapter two. Three million yen as a reward. A worth four trips around the world. All right, I'm gonna save, but next time I'll start the next chapter.
I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you then. Bye.